Alright guys, we're back with some we more Cleveland Indians franchise, and we are chugging along in the season. We are 75-64. and 64. We're still number two in the division. We were number two in the division last year, and we lost in the wild card game. We are number two in our division, number one in the wild card. So I am hoping we win this, and we go into the playoffs, number one in our division. Now we're number two in our division by three games so we need to win three games and we'll be number one for sure I have no doubt of that we got Carlos Carrasco starting today with a record of 12 and 8 with a high ERA of 3.54 close to that 400 mark but we are doing a player lock with Michael Brantley because he he has the best average on the team he has um, the second most home runs the most RBIs I think he is killing it and they just walk us I mean, of course he's got a kill in it. He's got freaking Michael Jordan's number on. So he better be doing something. But here we go. We got Crush Davis coming up to the bat. And we're going to move over. See if we can get the steal on this on this guy. Nathan Evaldi is who it is. And it knows it at first. All right, here we go. Michael Bradley trying to steal. And Crush Davis is going to hit that one right into shallow center field. So we have to stay on first. Could not get a steal that time. As I'm loving these graphics on uh, with this Indians ballpark, it's so better. The physical base rendering has been insane. But uh, we got Jose Batista up. You know he's got to hit us in, but you know he's our favorite. So hopefully he can do something. Here's the pitch. Jose Batista hits that one in center field. It's getting past the left uh, left fielder and center fielder. We're gonna go all the way home to get the score. So Jose Batista hopefully out of that slump with an RBI single because he's too slow to go to second. I'm pretty sure he could have went to second, but you know, Jose Batista slow. Look at that hit right down the middle. What were you doing, Nathan Evaldi? That was the worst pitch ever, and it cost him. And now we are back up to the plate in the bottom of the second. We are winning four to two already. The count's one to one with two outs. Nathan Evaldi. Here's the pitch, and. Oh, there's a bad swing and a miss there to move the count to one and two. Right, here we go, Nathan Vaughty with the pitch. Mike Brantley stays off of that pitch, so it is now two balls, two strikes. We've got to hit this. We've got to do something here. Every player lock we've done, we haven't done really much for any of the player locks except for Jose Batista. A great eye by Michael Brantley there. Let's see if he can get a hit this time. Instead of a walk, here's the pitch. And we strike out with that high fastball. He made us look like a freaking retard there. Nathan Evaldi with the nasty break on that fastball. As now we look at that Cleveland background. That's nice. That is really, really nice. I'm glad they added that to the game. So every stadium you're playing at, you're going to be able to see that. So now here we go to the top of the fourth. Our first chance to do any fielding. I've never done center, center, uh, fielding in MLB The Show 16. I did it in MLB The Show 15, and it was kind of difficult. As, like I said, it's kind of difficult. I run back. I probably could have caught that if Trevor Plouffe had to run up, and I didn't run backwards for some reason. But here we go. We got another chance to come to the plate and hit something. The count is 2-1. and one. Nathan Evaldi still pitching. We are winning 5-2 to two this time with two outs. Here's the pitch. And we just fouled that back to the catcher. Four out number three, and we still, still do not have a hit. And Michael Brantley was coming into this game with a big and long hit streak. So hopefully we don't lose that for Mike Brantley. All right, here we go. 6-4. to four. This game is... A lot of offense in it. It's a good game then. They got a new pitcher in the ball game. Of course, now, as we foul that one off, Mike Brantley looked like he had a piece of that one fell to his knee. That's Adrian Beltre style. All right, here's the pitch. And we pop that one into the foul territory. I thought it could have landed fair in the left field, but it did not. It went in the out. It went in uh, the stands. So here is the next pitch. What can we do with it? We strike out with one of the nastiest sliders ever. Oh my gosh. He got us with the slider. That was a little bit embarrassing, but we're still winning. Well, it's 6-5 to five now, top of the ninth. No outs. Jacob, Jacoby Ellsbury. I said Jacob Ellsbury. What is this? All right, now here's the pitch. And we're going to be able to get to that one. See how the view is a lot different this year. Last year, you saw it and you followed the ball as it was hit. This time, you see it get hit, and there's a little circle on the ground. But that is going to do it here for us. Well, for me, we win 6 
to five, and Kobe Rasmus with a home run. No, yeah, Kobe Rasmus with a home run and Crush Davis with a home run. So great game as we get another victory towards that number one division spot. So like, subscribe, and comment. I am out.